You're now listening to Tough Tiger Talk on the PRO Media Network. Much love to the LSU football fight family. Shout out to the LSU basketball family, both men and women, as they make a climb, man, in the tournament moving forward. So much love to the Tiger Nation. In this episode's LSU football lands, ex-Arizona State Sun Devil star QB Jaden Daniel. So in this episode, man, we're going to cover uh, that information as well. So please feel free to hit upon the like button, uh, hit the subscribe button and join the Tough Tiger Talk Nation. Now, this is pretty big, man. As you see, uh, the coaches continue to build his staff. Brian Kelly doing whatever he can to facilitate a change in Death Valley and build the culture. And he's definitely, if anything, is adding competition as he looks to add competition with this young quarterback, Mr. Jaden Daniels, which is a very big move. So let's cover this family as we go. LSU football lands, ex-Arizona State Sun Devil star QB, Jaden Daniels. Let's cover the article as presented by uh, ESPN. And it's letting you know, man, we got this kid. And it's pretty big. Let's go into it. Arizona State quarterback Jay Nellis has committed to play at LSU. Head coach Brian Kelly announced on Sunday the decision delivers LSU one of the most accomplished quarterbacks to enter the NCAA transfer portal this offseason. Daniels threw for over 6,000 yards and 32 touchdowns during his three seasons at Arizona State as primarily the starter. He's expected to be a contender to start at LSU, which has a strong quarterback room, but no obvious starter. He'll be competing with the trio of redshirt senior Miles Brennan and redshirt freshman Garrett Nussmeyer and early enrollees Walker Howard. In addition, Daniels, there will be likely a robust quarterback competition in Kelly's first season as LSU's coach. Daniels is a graduate transfer, and he's continued to kind of put some things together. Y'all got to apologize. (laughs) My damn cat. cat. I got a cat and a dog, man, so (laughs) sometimes they want attention. All right, so heading into the 21 season, the six foot, 385 pound Daniels was considered as one of the country's top NFL prospects, and he's he seemed destined to be a three and done prospect. He was the first player in Arizona State history to start his first career game and led the Sun Devils to an eight and five record in a bowl win over Florida State. He entered the NCAA transfer portal on February the 18th, a decision that came after releasing the video in December that said he'd be staying at Arizona State. His departure has been a blow to the Sun Devils program that has been riddled with coaching staff turnover and roster uncertainty as the NCAA continues to investigate recruiting violations in the Herm Edwards program. So very tough there for Herm Edwards, but very good for the Tiger Nations as we land Mr. Jaden Daniels to our team to compete with Walker Howard and and Miles Brennan. This is going to be a nice stiff competition because we was looking at that. Now let's take a look at some, the scouting prospect on uh, Jaden Daniels as provided by 24 seven sports. And this is what they gave his high school scouting report uh, possessing a naturally slender build and frame narrowly uh, narrow through the shoulders and upper body it should take on some bulk at the next level. Once he gets in college strength program uh, and he did ascend, he's an athletic quarterback that has some good skills, a lot of playmaking ability, as you can see on the skill right there, 6'3", 175, that he did pick up some. He has good speed, good delivery, really smart quarterback, processes the game very fast. And let me tell you something. This is a very good uh, pickup by LSU. Gives him a dynamic young pass catcher, athletic uh, at the position, very heady, high football IQ. And it's not a sporadic quarterback. Actually has pretty decent accuracy and a lot of playing experience. This kid played and started as a redshirt freshman. He started as a freshman for Arizona State. And this is really a steal by Brian Kelly picking up Jay Nellis and bringing him into the fold. So what does it look like with the competition? As you can see, uh, Brennan, uh, Miles Brennan is there at the quarterback position, Garrett Nussmeyer and Walker Howard, the freshman. So uh, he's walking on and a lot of people see this as a very good uh, move in terms of him possibly being a starting quarterback. A lot of people would not be afraid to say that Jaden Ellis is leading the charge and being the the uh, favorite to win the quarterback position. So LSU, who's going to be the quarterback, we see Jaden uh, uh, Daniels comes on to the team along with 
the rest of the offensive line. Brian Kelly's built up. John Emery Jr. returns at the running back position. That should help out. You have our wide receivers there as well, which is a positive. The defense is going to be lights out. Questions as, as far as the secondary is concerned. Got a lot of transfer portal players there uh, to acclimate. But listen, this is a very good move for LSU, and it's going to show you that Coach Kelly is building a culture, and he's getting the right players in to run his system and scheme. So this is going to be fun to watch moving ahead in the process. So listen, tell me what you guys think about uh, Jaden Daniels, and who do you think? will be the starting quarterback come the regular season. It's going to be a stiff competition, very fun. And you know, it's always a positive to have these young quarterbacks to come on and compete for it, whether it's Walker Howard or Miles Brennan. But a lot of people like Jaden Daniels to win the job. What do you think? You guys tell me in the comments section what you think will happen at the quarterback position. But most certainly, Brian Kelly is bringing players here and attracting some very good talent to LSU in an attempt to build a perennial winner a perennial winner, not a sporadic one, but a perennial one that's always mixed amongst the tops to compete for a national championship. So here we go. So with that being said, I'm going to end the show. Much love to you guys. Thank you for joining us for Tough Tiger Talk. Please feel free to subscribe, like, and share the show with other F Tough Tiger Talk family in the nation. Much love to you guys, and I'll see you later. Go Tigers.